हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू फार्मासपियंस दिस इज आशीष पाठक हेयर टुडे वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन ऑफ कैल्शियम चैनल ब्लॉकर्स अ क्लास ऑफ ड्रग्स दैट हेल्प इन कंडीशंस लाइक हाइपरटेंशन एंड एंजाइना टू मेक दिस कॉन्सेप्ट क्रिस्टल क्लियर आई विल एक्सप्लेन इट स्टेप बाय स्टेप विथ सिंपल एनिमेशन सो let's get started before understanding how calcium channel blockers work let's first see how smooth muscle contract and what role calcium ions play in this process we will see in this animation the contraction of smooth muscles involves several key steps so we start with normal smooth muscle contraction when a uh, stimulus activates smooth muscle cells voltage gated calcium channels on the membranes open calcium ions rush in from outside the cell increasing intracellular calcium levels this triggers the release of even more calcium ions from the sarcoplasmic reticulum the cells internal calcium store now this calcium binds to a protein called calmodulin to form a complex calcium calmodulin complex this is an essential complex in muscle contraction this calcium calmodulin complex activates an enzyme called myosin light chain kinase or mlck this enzyme phosphorylates myosin light chains a process that allows myosin to interact with actin filaments finally this interaction between myosin and actin results in muscle contraction so we are considering here vascular smooth muscle so we can see here vaso contraction this is how smooth muscle cells in our blood vessels tighten increasing blood pressure now let's see what happens when we introduce calcium channel blockers these drugs block voltage gated calcium channels on the smooth muscle cell membrane reducing the entry of extra cellular calcium into the cell with less calcium coming in intracellular calcium levels drop and less calcium is released from sarcoplasmic reticulum and because there is not enough calcium the formation of calcium calmodulin complex is significantly reduced this results in less activation of mlck leading to reduction in myosin light chain phosphorylation with fewer phosphorylated myosin molecules actin myosin interaction is inhibited and the smooth muscle relax this leads to vasodilation this is the mechanism of action of calcium channel blockers widely used for the treatment of hypertension and angina but when we consider myocardial calcium channel blockers they can be used for the treatment of arrhythmia thank you and to get more such type of videos subscribe our channel pharma sapiens and you can also visit our official website pharmasapiens.com